What up? It's me again. I wanted to do a follow-up video on yesterday's video talking about whatnot because there's still people out there who, I guess, don't believe me that you can get really good deals on there. I talked about in that video how I paid very little money for a bunch of Ninja Turtle toys. Those toys actually came in today. I'm pretty sure I ordered them on Friday or Saturday, so like two, three days later, they were here. Shout outs to the guy for shipping them super fast. They weren't even like the same state as me, but I got eight Turtles toys here, and I want to say I paid either 110 or 120 I'll just say 120 I'll go on the higher end of the spectrum but I got eight toys out of this and you're gonna be thinking well they're probably crappy toys they're probably in bad condition no they are not now growing up I didn't have any turtles toys I didn't have any x-men toys that's kind of why I get those things the Ghostbusters same thing my cousin Nicholas had all of these he had all of these because his mother got government cheese and she would just buy him a bunch of toys video games he had everything so I'd go over to his house and play a lot with him I did have Power Rangers um I remember I was a big White Ranger fan when Tommy the Green Ranger became the White Ranger. Yeah, that cool song. White Ranger Tiger Power. White Ranger Tiger Power. Very good that they put the word Ranger in there because you remove the the Ranger from that from that song. It gets a completely different song. But anyways, I want to show you guys the toys. I want to show you guys what I got to show you that you can get good deals on whatnot and that I'm not full of shit. So first off, let's take a look at these. Now these are the re-releases I don't care. I don't care. I like crispy. Okay. I like crispy in box. No sorts of issues. Look at this Raphael. Look at it. It's beautiful. This is the Playmates re-release and it, it, it looks fantastic. It looks so good. Look, look at, look at how crispy everything is. Look at how everything pops. The colors, the backing, the story of who he is. This is awesome. This is to me is just as good as getting the originals when you're a child. You know why? Because when you look at how much those originals run for nowadays, they're like a hundred bucks a figure, if not more, and sealed. I got all these for the price of one of the old figures sealed. So here's Raphael looking great. Let's go to the next one here. I'm not editing this properly either, so there will be no cuts. Oh, who's next? Oh, I don't know, maybe Leonardo? Maybe Leonardo, look at, look at the colors. Look at the colors, the Katana blades. Just everything is so crispy. So, oh man, I'm, I'm sorry. I love to smell a new video game. You open it up, you smell it, it's got that smell. I love crispy toys. Crispy toys on my eyes is just magic. Beautiful, beautiful Leonardo. Uh, you could probably take a guess at who might be next. Donatello. Donatello, the staff master himself with his weaponries. He's got a, a bow. They call it a bow. It's a fucking staff. Just call it what it is. Looking at the back once again, we have all the information. Crispy. I, the, look at the colors. Greens and blues and pinks and purples just popping off. Like, so awesome, man. So awesome. And, you know, I don't even know what these go for. I have no idea what these go for. However... When I buy a bunch of them for $120, I'm feeling like I got a good deal. Let me know in the comments. Maybe maybe this wasn't a good deal. Maybe I got ripped off, but I don't want to go to the toy store and deal with a bunch of little kids in the toy aisle putting their little COVID fingers on everything. They're fucking boogers, sneezing on them, coughing on them. Their mom's an idiot who doesn't know what anything is. Get away from me. Get away from me. And of course, you have to have the party dude alongside of people Michelangelo just mm, crispy crispy so if I got these four for $120 I would say that's a pretty decent haul you know what's that $30 a figure okay for not having to go to the store for not having to deal with humans $30 a figure that seems pretty reasonable but no like I said I got four more in this bundle no no deals on whatnot what are you an idiot Get a little rock steady going on here. Little little rock steady. The original 88 figures, the classic collection, reborn. Um, awesome looking figure. I, I remember Nicholas did have this this figure. Um, very cool looking stuff. You know, shout big. Let's give a round of fucking applause to Nickelodeon for re-releasing turtle stuff. The Kawabunga collection, the arcade one-up, the toys. Like you understand. That the people who grew up watching your shit are now old, crusty men like me who just want these toys. So, very cool. Big Rock Steady fan. Here's an awesome one. I love Baxter Stockman. Baxter Stockman is one of the coolest figures, characters in the world. And this is an awesome, 
awesome looking figure i love this figure the attention to detail on it is great he looks just like the motherfucker in turtles in time which was my big introduction to baxter stockman looking at the back once again just such high quality stuff here such such high quality stuff two more to go reach hope i don't show my ass on here i've been known to show my ass on the small cast can't have rock steady without bebop so we got a little bebop action going here surprisingly this is the figure i paid the most for some someone came into the the stream like i said there was like 13 people max in that stream and i saw these figures and i was like i want every fucking one of them and one guy kept trying to outbid me for the bebop i kind of overpaid for this one a little bit i felt but whatever i mean it's a clean looking figure box is in great condition extra crispy and of course digging into my arm the side of my body all right and of course you got to have this guy and yes i do not it's not who you think it is you probably are thinking it's shredder i actually had to purchase shredder and splinter separately because they were not included in this bundle but i wanted them in my collection but it is someone that i feel is right up there with shredder because it's krang krang is the coolest I, I, I don't know what it is about Krang, but I love Krang. I think Krang is amazing. I had a high school teacher who kind of reminded me of Krang. There was one teacher that reminded me of Krang, Krang, and there's one teacher that reminded me of the clown from the Spawn movie. Remember how it was like the short, it was like uh, John Leguizamo, but it was he was like short and fat. There was a teacher that looked just like, and her smile looked just like that. But you got to have Krang, because Krang rules ass. So let's recap here, kitties. That is eight figures for i think it was 110 but we're gonna say 120 dollars now i'm not a mathematician i'm not the greatest person at math in the world but we established that if i paid for 120 dollars for four figures that would be 30 dollars a pop so these cost me 15 dollars a pop you can't beat that 15 dollars a pop shipped to my house and i got all these i didn't have to go deal with grubby little kids i didn't have to go to a million different stores wasting gas i got these for 120 dollars I don't think you could beat that, man. I don't think you could beat that. So like I said, use that video to learn the tip, the tricks and tips of the trade in order to get the good stuff on there. Tonight, there's a Dick Tracy lot going up and I have my keen little eye on it. Unfortunately, it's going up at a prime time. It's going up at like 6.30, so I'm a little bit worried, but I want some Dick Tracy figures as well because I think they're really cool. Ideally, the walls here are just going to be filled with uh, toys and you might be saying well why are you buying all these toys and it's because one day youtube is gonna go shit up for me i'm sure and i won't be able to make money on it so that's when i sell all my toys all my video games and i retire and i live a beautiful happy life with my money from my video games and my toys and if youtube allows me to not retire because the money keeps coming in well then it's a win-win i have a bunch of video games and a bunch of toys that i'll be buried with bury me with my toys bury me with my video games i'll catch you guys on the next one go check out the whatnot video